birds here in Akron are just amazing. They make life beautiful and sweet. You know what they say, the earth without art is eh. My husband and I were both born and raised in Akron. And as elementary school students, we got to attend Children's Concert Society um, concerts. They used to bring the Cleveland Orchestra in to the old Akron Armory, the same place where we saw the circus and where you could go see the fights. But it was a wonderful exposure to symphonic music. And, and we both also took painting and drawing lessons at the old Akron Art Institute uh, before it became just a museum when the, the teaching part moved over to the University of Akron. But as kids, we went there on Saturday mornings. We weren't in the same classes. I don't think we knew each other then. But uh, we both had that opportunity. And I got, having been a piano student, got to participate in Tuesday Musical, uh, junior high and high school, Allegro Club and Brahms Club events. Then after my husband and I were married in 1961, we would attend uh, the old Akron Symphony when it was primarily an amateur organization and of course have enjoyed its newfound professional status and excellence and um, have attended museums and really just love participating in all the different things that Akron has, has offered. The arts have a role to play in calming us, soothing us, teaching us patience in a way, teaching us that things go on no matter what. Uh, the, the permanence of art as opposed to the impermanence, impermanence of the pandemic. Um, it's, it's just an essential part of our human existence, I think. I'm not sure I can put it into as many words as I should.